Dear friends, this is Prithviraj from Bangalore connecting with you once again through this short message on Golden Rule. In Matthew 7:12 we read that so in everything do to others what you would have them do to you for this sums up the law and the prophets. This verse is considered as the golden rule. This verse is synonymous to the second great commandment which says you shall love your neighbor as yourself. This is the essence of the entire sermon on the mount mentioned in 5th to 7th chapters of Matthew gospel. By saying that this sums up the law and the prophets. Jesus presents this golden rule as the summary for the entire moral law. This verse is related with the teaching to love the enemies in Matthew 5:44 in Luke 6:31 this rule is present in the context of teachings about loving our enemies this golden rule is all about the principles of relationship relationships would be at its best when we use this rule in our relationships What we wish upon others we wish upon ourselves it conveys to do the same actions that we want others to do to us it conveys us to guide our behavior in the same way that we want others to behave if we regard other people's possessions families job and ministry in the same way we regard our world the impacts changes and the transformations it can make or unlimited the passage do to others what you would have them do to you would mean that if we want respect we ought to respect others if we want love we need to love others if we want to be helped we have to help others If we want to be listened we have to listen to others practicing the golden rule would mean empathizing with other people including those who may be very different from us it is the ability to experience how others view and feel it would mean placing ourselves in the shoes of another person and trying to understand others in their perspective do to others what you would have them do to you would mean that we make efforts to understand how others want to be treated and then doing that generally we keep our eyes shut to the needs and troubles of others if we understand another person and feel what they are going through then there is a possibility to take some actions to ease their suffering in some way without the love for neighbor the love of god remains a barren emotion though we are conditioned to control people the golden rule is not about controlling others but providing freedom autonomy and trust Though we have the tendency to strike back when we are treated badly the rule is about treating others well despite how they treat us when we start applying the golden rule our daily life would change we would behave responsibly in public we would listen more help more we will try to see the similarities between us and others despite the differences we will hold back criticism and instead learn to interact with others in a positive way we will not take advantage of someone we will not lie or cheat to get ahead because we would not want others doing that to us by making a decision to do to others what we would want others to do to us we open up to a process of change it's a way of denying self and allowing a gradual transformation to change our character from inside out 
May God enable us to do to others what we would want others to do to us. Amen. Thank you for listening. God bless you.